Hi, I'm Peaks and Fitness Friends. It's Rayanne here with your Empowered Move. So today I want to talk about a hamstring stretch, and we've been noticing this a little bit in class. So to do a hamstring stretch seated or forward fold, um, we, we're noticing a lot of this happening with the pelvis. So you want to sit up tall up onto those two little bones underneath you, and maybe the knees have to be bent in that case. Um, we want to lengthen the knees as much as we can and draw the toes towards the shins as much as you can. And you want to be keep a long spine rather than tucking the pelvis under because the hamstrings attach underneath the pelvis. We want to drive the pelvis, tilting it forward so that you have your pubic bone pressing down, the ribs reaching forward, and the spine stays long. And maybe you're here. You just work your range of motion and you get as far as you can first and then you can round through the spine and stretch through the back. But the goal initially is to keep that length through the knees, through the hamstrings, through the pelvis, through the spine, through the neck and shoulders. So you're getting that beautiful length first and then rounding over. The same thing standing up. So in a standing forward fold, we want to be lengthened here, drive the sits bones back, the rib cage comes forward, supporting yourself with your hands to protect the lower back. You're going where you can go with a long spine first, holding it there, feeling the length in the hamstrings, engaging the feet, pulling the inner thighs together, then let go and round through the spine. But initially, you want to keep that spine long instead of this. So this is what we see in class. This is what we want to see in class. And maybe your range of motion is here in that position. Do not focus on getting your chest to your knees. Think about lengthening from behind the leg all the way into the glutes, creating that length so that you can get the stretch in the hamstrings that you need. So we hope that's helpful. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.